Hi everyone, I'm Apollonia Ponti, your dating and relationship coach, founder of ApolloniaPonti.com, and welcome to today's video. I'm so happy you're here. I'm your coach for you men to master your confidence, build the attraction skills, and to really cultivate that relationship and get that woman that you truly desire. In today's video, I am going to talk about 10 simple tips to get a girl's attention. This is your first time visiting. I welcome you and I'm so happy you're here. I encourage you to click that subscribe button so you can get notified every time I post new videos. Let's get into it. Tip number one is help someone. So depending on where you are, if you're at school, if you're at work, if you see this girl one more than one or two times, or maybe if you see her out, you know, if someone drops something, pick it up show her that you are a caring individual like you're actually going out of your way to help someone if there's an older lady that is trying to carry her groceries and you are you go to you work at a grocery store you work somewhere <laughs> that has bags that need to be lifted go and help this woman out and put it in her car or whatever it is show her that you can adapt to different situations in a time that people need you. And women are so attracted to that. Um, when you can put yourself in a predicament to help someone. And I think that you should always be helping someone, not only just to get a girl's attention. Tip number two. Oh, and because I said that, I just remembered something I did yesterday, which would be such a great thing for you guys to do in a day. I should actually do a video on this. And it just came into my head. This is a really good tip for you on the date. Let's just say you pick each other up, been dating a couple of days or one day, two, three dates go by and you park somewhere and you have to pay, right? So I always, I always try to pride myself on doing a good deed for somebody. And we, my boyfriend and I were um, out and we had to pay for parking. We paid for parking and I opened the door as he was paying because I noticed someone else was coming for parking and there were just a family, like a bunch of kids in the family and I got out of my car and I went around the car and I told the meter, the lady at the stand that I was going to pay for their parking and they gave him like the cash for their parking. They were like, wow, like, thank you. That's so nice. And even the meter maid was like, wow, I can't believe you just did that. And I had no idea who they were. This is the stuff that really we need in this today's world. All right, now let's get back to the topic. I just gave you that little bonus tip. <laughs> tip number two, find a connection with her, right? So find a connection with her when you start talking to her. This is gonna get her attention. So if she likes yoga, if she likes hiking, if she likes cooking, tell her about a pastry making class that you did before or tell her how you tried to bake a croissant and you burnt it and you're horrible with cooking. Even though you don't have that similarity of culinary skills because you burnt a croissant, you're still forming a connection by humor and listening to what she has to say. And then talk about like what you like to do. Maybe you guys will find things in common. Tip number three is body language. Um, attract her with your smile and your eye contact. A lot of times um, women love like when they see a man that just smiles at them and shows eye contact. Yeah, I get it. A lot of women don't give you eye contact and don't smile. Then if they don't, then those are the type of women that don't need to get attention because also they might have to pay attention to their attention be, to their body language because of the fact that if they're like this and they're not looking at you, it's probably because they have someone else and they're just, or they're just not interested. So it's really important that you do that. And um, body language is key. Number four is being watching your language, being positive um, with your demeanor, like chest up, putting your positivity out there in conversations and being careful of your language. So I put this in one of the tips because of the fact that maybe you're just in a conversation with a bunch of people and she's in the same area or she's listening, whatever it is. It's just be positive in who you are, right? You don't want to pretend like you're anything that you're not because women feel that type of energy when a man is coming from a place of lack and that's what I talk about a lot. And I don't ever encourage you to be someone you're not, but I do encourage you to emphasize on who you are and this is what I mean number five is notice the small changes that she's made so maybe you guys run into each other every once in a while and she dyed her hair notice it and pay her that compliment um, in regards to the things that have changed about her tip number six kind of like tip number five but pay her a compliment but a woman will never get sick of hearing a compliment so compliment her on something that you want it doesn't always have to be the cliche comment of oh you're so beautiful no but compliment her on her style or um another good thing could be is compliment her on her presence how she carries herself you know a lot of women 
take a lot of pride in the way they carry themselves. And it shows that a man is looking besides the fact of her beauty is looking at her besides the fact of her beauty when you compliment her presence. Tip number seven, share something humorous. You know, a lot of times men are so big on not calling themselves out, but it's funny because when you a man calls himself out also shows confidence. So that's one way you can showcase humor or do something humorous or share something in common or make a joke out of something that you're both talking about. Tip number eight, show her other girls like you. Okay, wait, I don't want you to be like, oh, I'm going on a date here and this girl likes me. No, 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 no. Just like enjoy your time and if you're talking this is what i mean like if you're around people and it's not just her and you like show her that there's other women that you can talk to and that you can find that are laughing with you she's going to find that intriguing that you can carry a conversation and she's going to want to know what this conversation is all about so it's harder for you to have conversations with someone you like and easier to for you to have conversations with women that you really don't interest you try there first and let her see it and then have her slowly come into the conversation because it'll warm you up a little bit Tip number nine is be a leader in some way that kind of steers on to tip number eight a little bit, but be a leader in some way, like show her that you're a boss in some way of your life. So you take leadership in some type of role that you have in your life. Like maybe you go, or you dedicate time to a nonprofit. Maybe you're your own boss, whatever it is, showcase that. And tip number 10, the ultimate greatest tip of all, just say, hello. There's nothing wrong with just saying hello. And at the end of the day, if she rejects you, then all you got to do is move on. I know it's hard to sometimes say and face rejection and hear the fact that you can just move on like that. But at the same time, you are one step closer to getting with your, what you want. If you are the man that goes after what you want. If you liked today's video, please comment below and give it a thumbs up. And I love hearing from you. So please make sure that you comment below. Um, and I'll try it if you have any questions and I'll try to my best to get back to you as always. I'll see you again in the next video. Remember you are always loved. Bye for now.